Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Saibel Explains. This video is all about multiplying integers using algebra tiles. Let's take note of the following. 1 green square is equal to 1 or positive 1 and 1 red square is equal to negative 1. And a pair of green and red square is equal to 0 and it is called a zero pair. Okay, let's have some examples. Let's have this one. Two times three is equal to blank. It means add two sets of three. We'll be having two sets of three. If we're going to add this, we'll have one, two, three, four, five, and six. That's six. Positive six. Let's have another one that's 2 times negative 3. It means add 2 sets of negative 3. It is represented by 3 red squares in a set. We'll be having one set and another set. That's all in all 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. We'll have negative 6 as our answer. What if our example is this? negative 2 times 3. It means we have to remove two sets of positive 3. We'll be using zero pair to explain this question. We'll be having two sets of three zero pairs. That's one and another one. Back to the question, we will remove two sets of positive 3. So we'll be removing the greens one set of green at the top and one set of green at the bottom and what was left were the six red squares telling us it is negative six our final answer is negative six another example that's negative two times negative three it means we will remove two sets of negative three we'll be using the zero pairs we'll have two sets of three zero pairs that's one set and another set let's go back to the question it says there that we will remove two sets of negative three so we'll be removing one set of negatives at the top and another set in the bottom what was left were the greens telling us that our answer is positive 6. It is easy, right? Okay, let's see. Now, it is your time to solve. Please write your answer in the comments section. The question is, which of the following is the value of n? n is equal to negative 4 times 5. Is it a 9, b negative 9, c 20, and d negative 20? I'll be waiting for your answer. Thank you. Don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time.